Hello everyone, how are you? I'm Fiore and today we are going to start today's class with a page from the book. So, please open the Get Ready for Starters book on page 32. Get Ready for Starters book, page 32. Let me know when you're there on the chat. I'll wait for you. You're ready? Okay, so, story and listening. Number one, listen and read. Okay, so here we have a story, okay? We need to listen to the story and read it, okay? So, let's hear. Listening 19. Listen and read. Then act. One. Look, here's Lucy. Where? Over there. What's she wearing? Two. She's wearing her new t-shirt and her favorite jeans. Yes, and she's holding a bag. Three. Now I see her. Yes, I like her bag, and her t-shirt, and her jeans. Four. Oh, no! Okay, so let's hear again and pay attention to what is Lucy wearing. But before we listen one more time, look at the word that repeats over and over again. Look, we have the word wearing. Wearing. ¿Qué está usando? ¿Qué está vistiendo? What's she wearing? What is she wearing? And here we have, she's wearing her new t-shirt and her favorite jeans. Okay, so let's listen again. Listen and read, then act. One. Look, here's Lucy. Where? Over there. What's she wearing? Two. She's wearing her new t-shirt and her favorite jeans. Yes, and she's holding a bag. Okay, so... Who's wearing a green t-shirt? Who's wearing a green t-shirt? Yes, very good. Lucy is wearing a green t-shirt. Look, here is Lucy. And what color is her t-shirt? Very good. Yes, it's green. And what color are her jeans? Right on the chat. What color are her jeans? Are they white? Are they black? Are they red? Are they blue? Yes, very good. They are blue. Excellent. And what color are her shoes? What color are her shoes? Good. Yes. Very good. They are white. Excellent. Let's continue listening. Three. Now I see her. Yes. I like her bag. And her t-shirt. And her jeans. Four. Oh, no! Okay, good. So, look. Here we have, now I see her. I like her bag. And her t-shirt. And her jeans. 
look we use her to talk about a girl's clothes okay okay a girl's clothes okay let's continue say what lucy and alice are wearing this is alice and this is lucy what are they wearing we're going to write a sentence what are they wearing Good, okay, we're going to start our sentence with they. They are wearing a green t-shirt, blue jeans, and a pink bag. Excellent. Very good. And so we can say that their t-shirt is green their jeans are blue and their bags are pink. We use there to talk about more than one person. We use there to talk about more than one person. Okay? Good. And look, what is Sam wearing? What is Sam wearing? We need to color what Sam is wearing. Okay, and then we are going to write what Sam is wearing just like we did on exercise two. Okay, so let's listen and color. Listening 20. What is Sam wearing? Listen and colour. Oh, look! There's Sam. Where? Look! There! He's wearing blue trousers. Blue trousers. Oh, yes, I see him. Is he wearing a jacket? No, it's a shirt. It's green. So, he's wearing... A green shirt. That's right. And what colour are his shoes? Oh, he's got brown shoes. Brown? Yes. He's got some yellow socks on too. Yellow socks? I like that colour. Yes, me too. Do you really? Yes. And what's he holding? He's holding an orange bag. His bag's orange. Yes, it is. And he's holding some grapes, too. Oh, what colour are they? They're purple. Purple grapes. Very nice. And is Sam wearing his watch today? Yes, he is. What colour is it? It's red. Red's a good colour for a watch. Yes, it is. I'd like a nice new watch. Would you? Yes. Okay, good. So, were you able to colour? Excellent. Okay, so, what colour is Sam's shirt? Yes, very good. It's green. It's green. Excellent. And what about his shoes? What about his shoes? What color are they? 
Yes, they are brown. Brown. Excellent. And what about his socks? What color are his socks? Yes, very good. Yellow. Excellent. And his bag, this one. What color is it? What color is his bag? Good, very good. It's orange. It's orange. Excellent. And he has some grapes. What color are the grapes? Yes, the grapes are purple. Very good. And his watch. What color is his watch? Yes, very good. It's red. Excellent. Red. Okay, now we can write our sentences. Okay, so here we're going to write. Yes, very good. We're going to write with his. His shirt is green. His watch is red. His grapes are purple. His socks are yellow. What else? What color is his bag? Very good. His bag is orange. And what color are his shoes? His shoes. Yes, his shoes are brown. And his jeans are what color? Yes, very good, are blue. Excellent. His shirt is green. His watch is red. His grapes are purple. His socks are yellow, his bag is orange, his shoes are brown, and his jeans are blue. Excellent. Very good. Okay, and we use his to talk about a boy's clothes. Okay, to talk about a boy's clothes. Very good. Okay, and now we're going to practice these words we highlighted. His, their, and her. We are going to practice these words in a handout. Okay, look, this handout. His. Her and their. So, let's open this handout. You can close the book now. We are finished with the book. And open this handout. His, her or their. Look at the page 32 of the book Get Ready for Starters and complete the rules. Remember. When we talk about Sam's clothes, we use 
When we talk about Sam's clothes, we use which word? Yes, very good. His. His. We use his when we are talking about a boy. So here we are going to write his. So we use his for a boy. For example, his trousers are blue. His trousers are blue. Excellent. When we talk about Lucy's clothes, we use look. When we talk about Lucy's clothes, what do we use? Which word? Yes, her. Very good. Her. Excellent. So, we use her for a girl. One girl. For example, her t-shirt is green. Her t-shirt is green. And when we talk about Lucy and Alice, Alice's clothes, we use, which one do we use? Yes, very good, there. We use there. Their t-shirts are green, their jeans are blue, and their bags are pink. Excellent. So, we use their. Very good. We use their for plural to talk about more than one person's clothes. For example, their bags are pink. Their bags are pink. Okay, good. Highlight this remember box, okay? Highlight them like this. Very good. Okay, now look, read and complete. This is Ian. Mm, shorts are blue. What word do we need to use for Ian? He is a boy. So, do we use his, her or their? Which word do we use? His, her or their? Good, we use his. His shorts are blue. Excellent. And here we have Ruth. This is Ruth. Mm, dress is purple. Mm, dress is purple. Do we use his? Do we use her? Or do we use their? For the girl. Yes, very good. For the girl, we use her. Her dress is purple. And these are Jim and Luke. And here we need another word. Do we use his, her or their? Shoes are black. Very good. We have more than one person. Okay, we have plural. So... We need to write there. Their shoes are black. Excellent. And now, try these sentences. He's wearing gray shoes. He is wearing gray shoes. If we have he, we are talking about a boy. So which word are we going to use? His, her or their? Very good. His. His shoes are grey. Excellent. She's wearing a red jacket. She's wearing a red jacket. We are talking about she, a girl. So, do we write his, her or their? 
Very good. Yes. Her. Excellent. Her jacket is red. And here we have Simon. Simon is wearing a purple umbrella. Simon is wearing a purple umbrella. Simon is a boy. So, do we write his, her, or their? Very good. His, his umbrella is purple. Very good. And sentences D, E, and F are for homework, okay? These three sentences are for homework. Good. Now, I'm going to ask you to go to the Simpsons handout. Do you remember the handout? This one. We have already completed the first sentences. The sentences with apostrophe S. Do you remember what was this for? When do we use this? Very good. Yes, to talk about someone's belongings. Yes. Here we are saying that the dress belongs to Lisa. Lisa has a dress and the dress is orange. Very good. Okay, now we are going to write different sentences. We are going to finish this handout. Okay, so we know that Lisa is a girl. So, are we going to use his, her, or their? Good, we are going to use her. Her dress, what color is it? Very good, yes, is orange. Excellent. And so, we can say that she is wearing... An orange dress. Excellent. And now we are going to do the same with the rest of the sentences. If we are talking about Lisa, we are talking about a girl. So we are going to write her. Her shoes are what color? Yes, orange. Very good. And we can say that Lisa or she is wearing orange shoes. Very good. Lisa's necklace is white. Her necklace Is what color? Yes, white. Very good. So we can say that she is wearing a white necklace. Excellent. We've completed Lisa's sentences. Now let's go to Bart. Let's go to Bart. Bart's t shirt is orange. Bart's t-shirt is orange. So are we going to use his, her, or their? Bart is a boy. So, very good, yes. His t-shirt is orange. Excellent. He is wearing an orange t-shirt. Excellent. Okay, now Bart's shorts are light blue. Bart's shorts are light blue. So, are we going to use his, her or their? Very good, his. So, his shorts are light blue. Excellent. And we can say that he is wearing 
the light blue shorts. Excellent. Very good. Okay, Bart's trainers are light blue. So, are we going to use his, her, or their? Excellent. His, his trainers are light blue. Fantastic. And so, we can say that he is wearing light blue trainers. Excellent. And we finish with Bart's sentences as well. So now we can do Patty's and Selma's. Okay, so here we have Patty and Selma's dresses are blue and pink. We have two persons, okay, two people, Patty and Selma. So are we going to use his? Her or their? Yes, excellent. We are going to use their. Their dresses are blue and pink. Excellent. They are wearing different color dresses. Dos colores diferentes de vestidos. One is blue and the other is pink. Excellent. Patty and Selma's shoes are blue and pink. Very good, yes. Their shoes are blue and pink. Excellent. And so we can say that they are wearing different color shoes. And on to the last set of sentences. Patty and Selma's necklaces are pink. Yes, very good. So their necklaces are what color? Yes, very good. Only one color, pink. Excellent. And so we can say that they are wearing pink necklaces. Excellent. Okay, very good, guys. I'm going to give you some time for you to finish copying. You let me know when you finish. Write on the chat when you're finished. Good, excellent. Don't worry if you haven't finished copying because you can watch the class again and finish the sentences, okay? Very good. Okay, excellent. So, that is all for today's class. Now you're going to Zoom and you're going to continue working with your teacher. Okay, bye-bye and see you next class.